Hello YouTube, Minecraft Team is here, and this is the tutorial on how to install Pixelmon. Um, first you'll need a new folder, you'll need MultiMC, you need Optifine, and you'll need Pixelmon. So, um, all those links will be in the description. Um, uh, so, first off, you'll need um, to bring MultiMC into the new, new folder. By creating a new folder, you, you right-click your screen, go over new, then get a folder. Uh, you will first need to put this in here, click on it, then it creates all these folders. Um, you'll add a new instance, it's loading the version list. Don't worry about this, this does not matter, it still loads. You could change your picture, so let me just go to Steve. Um, um, no. You would change the version. Current doesn't really work, so you'll have to put it to 1.5.1. It says it's an old version. Don't worry about it. it it's the same version. Um, press OK. Now you have a new folder. You'll press on new. You'll have these username and password. Don't worry about that right now. Um, you're gonna right click Steve, so um, right click him, and then you come down to here to edit mods. Uh, Monty MC is really cool. It comes with Forge. Like it, when you press on this, it installs Forge with, for you. So just press on that. Loading list. You'll want to go to the latest version. So you just double click on that, and then press OK. Then it uh, brings up Forge. Now you have Forge. So then you would close that. Now you're going to go to um, View Folder. View Folder is just bin, basically. The way you would install in, install regular, um, install regular mods. Then you do View Folder. You will need a, a zip file to open your, um, open these two folders. Uh, Optifine is optional. I prefer to use it because it doesn't lag, it makes my Minecraft faster. Um, then you come up with this stuff. This stuff. You're gonna open Pixelmon. Then it comes up with database and mods. You do not have a database, so you're gonna just drag this into here, so it creates a database. You're gonna open this mods, so it's empty. Then you open this mods, this isn't. So you just drag this into here. Oops, I didn't do that right. You drag this into here, so it's Pixelmon. Go back. Um, you go into bin. Oh, I have to restart my uh, Minecraft. You click out of all this. You would start new. So I'm just gonna. Um, remember username, remember password. Now it's downloading my Minecraft jar. Everything else. It's um gonna take a little while this is the console for it you can um you don't do anything with it I don't think you do anything with it it's just to show you uh, crash reports and stuff and how it's running so it's really cool cuz it brings up Steve it brings it don't worry about the not responding it it's just gonna stay like this for a little while cuz it's loading all the new mods and stuff so let's just okay four mods loaded mods Coder pack, Pixelmon! Yay, we did Pixelmon. Then crust done. Then you X out of that. Uh, now we're gonna install um, Optifine. It's just regular stuff. It's not very hard. Then open this with WinRAR. Just drag and drop. It's pretty easy. You do not have to delete. Um, I have to close out all these things. It's annoying. Dupe. Okay, so you can delete the Meta Imp. I would rather do that right now because I don't want my Minecraft crashing and embarrassing myself. Okay, now it's deleted. You would select all. Drag it into here. Okay. Um, click out of that, click out of that, let's start new, okay, 
Now it's going to load up the fine and um yeah. So now your Minecraft is loading. Well, it's not really Minecraft. This is my regular Minecraft. This is different jars and stuff. You can um add as many Minecrafts as you want with different mods in it. Um so you don't have to put in your regular Minecraft and when you have to install new mods, you can you have to restart it. It's just easier like this. So then you go to single player, create new world. Fun. Fun. Go and create. I'm going to go in creative for now. So I can show you all the new items. How many minutes are we on? Five. Um, I'm just going to briefly show you the simple items. This mod is r really detailed. It's really fun. Welcome to Pixelmon. Sorry for this. I can't really see. Welcome to Pixelmon. Thank you. Now, please pick your desired starter. Pokemon. So, um, Charmander was always my favorite. The fuck? Don't know what this is. Oops. So, um, let me just edit my settings. I'm just, I'll be right back when I'm done with my settings. Okay, I'm back. Um, so you start out with a starter Pokemon and your, um, Charmander. And see how it brings up Charmander, level 5. If you don't like that, you just press O. And it just brings up your Pokemon menu. That's all you have to do. It's pretty easy. Um, so, this mod is really detailed. You have to do a lot to get a lot of stuff. Um, let's try and catch some Pokemon. So, it brings up a whole new tab menu with... All the CDs, that's so cool. Head I uh, held items can hold all that. Um, you'll need these to make, uh, you'll need these Apricorns to make the uh, Pokeballs. Um, you make aluminum, you may, you could get Firestone, you could get, to power up your Pokemon, you could get Fossils. And then, um, F-O-S-S. -S. Th look at this, this is a Fossil Machine. You put down this Fossil Machine. Look how detailed it is. Look how it, look at it. You put in a fossil that you um purified, I guess you could say. Which is one of these. So I'm going to go with one of these. It's an, it's going to take a little while, so I'll pause the video. I'll be right back. Welcome back and <gasps> insert Pokéball. I didn't know you were so supposed to insert a Pokeball. One sec. Master. I want to get the Master Ball so I know I get him. Master. Master. How do I don't insert it. Where? Oh. M-A-S. Sorry. <laughs> I'll be back when this is better and stuff. That's the console. I'll be back when I'm done with it. Okay, guys, I'm back. Um, I got the shell on, and that's that. Okay, so to switch Pokemon, you can go into controls. Um, person left bracket. I think I'm just gonna go with um, um, G and H, I guess. G, H, G. Then you press R to let it go. Isn't he so cute? Okay. Um, the next thing is rare candy. R A. Rare. Rare candy. I am going to give these both to my um. What the fuck? Um, I'm gonna g be giving these uh to my Flappy. I catch you, master. I'm gonna be giving this to three Pokemon, and I'm gonna see their last evolution. Get the fuck in there. Come on, it's a master ball. And it's floating. Yeah, yeah, I captured Flaffy. Um, I'll be back when they're both level 100. Oh, well, all of them are level 100. Oopsies. I need to do what the hell. Oopsies. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, I'm back. Um... I made my um Pokemon level one hundred. So let's go fight someone. 
R. Time set zero. And I think that is the most coolest part. Um, you could battle trainers if I can find a trainer. They're fish Pokemon. You could find a. a you can find fish Pokemon. You could level them up. You can make them pretty. You can make them. I think they're gonna be. They may added badges too, so that's pretty cool. Let's go capture. S I didn't level them all the way. All of them up to a hundred. I like Growlithe. Let's go run. Ooh, there's a trainer. Let's go. Those are um apricorns, I think. I choose you. Yeah, buddy. Fight. Ancient power. <laughs> Against the loaf. <laughs> Yay. Fight. Ancient power. Waiting. Ancient power. So as you can see, um, level 100 is probably the most effective. My Pokemon, no, I am so sorry for you. I think he was drowning. But I'm not sure. Let's go. Well, that's it, guys. I'm gonna get this other trainer. Are you gonna fight him? Come on. You can fight him. Let's go. You idiot. Throw my Pokemon at you. Whatever. Let me go over to this other trainer that I think I saw. Let's catch this little thing that's in the grass. It's not even a block high. That's kind of weird. Well, that was it for today, guys. Let me just catch random Pokemon now. Um. Oh, I love that Pokemon. Um. So, I will be doing another tutorial like this. There are a lot of good Pokemon around. Um, I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.